good to have you on. You're back. And uh, you're back. You're up in weight class. How are you feeling? I feel great, uh, especially the week of the fight. You know, it's, it's a little different energy that I got to me. Uh, you know, we, we had a really hard training session yesterday, and uh, I was able to recover afterwards. So I, I feel like those will be the, the benefits that uh, you'll see going into this fight. I'll, I'll show up 100% healthy, which I think a lot of people are excited about. It's kind of a game of fine margins, and, and things can go so differently. I mean, we saw you fight for an interim title against Tony Ferguson. I think you had staff before that fight. You could have been fighting again for that lightweight title, but did it just did it just feel right uh, now to move up? Because it's something you've always spoken about, but do you think the timing feels right to you? Yeah, the, the, the timing with it all did. Uh, you know, the lightweight division got really log jammed, especially once you start getting to the top. So uh, I just wanted to fight, really. Uh, at lightweight, I would have been offering somebody a, a, a shot at a, at a higher-ranked opponent. Uh, but then when they came to me with, with Dos Anjos, it just made the, the perfect sense. You know, he's a former world champion. He's already fought the who's who of both divisions. So I knew he was going to show up and he was going to give me a good fight. Uh, he wasn't going to shy away from 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 the opportunity. So it, it made the right sense. And, and, you know, just speaking from me personally, you know, I think uh, uh, my thing is getting back to, to fighting my natural fighting style and the way I, I'm, I'm supposed to. Uh, and being healthy going into these fights is one of them. Uh, my whole career, I've been having a fight before the fight, uh, having to fight that scale. And, and now I don't have to worry about that. And, and I'm solely focused 100% on Dos Anjos. There was a lot of hype and a lot of excitement around you for, for quite some time because of your talent and because of who you are as a person. But given things haven't gone your way against Al in the last fight, do you feel the need to maybe remind a few people out there who, who you are in this game? It's still going to be there. Look, look on, on Saturday, I'm going to make sure I shake things up. You know, w welterweight is starting to be the new little marquee division. Uh, you're seeing, like, a lot of top talent and a lot of top guys up here. Uh, and it's getting people kind of riled up about the division. So once I show up on Saturday, uh, I, I'm going to shake some things up. And I'm, I'm, I'm going to remind some people of, of, of who I am and what, you know, I ain't going nowhere. I'm the youngest guy in this game for a reason. And uh, I'm sticking around for a long time. What do you make of the top of the division right now? I think a lot of people were were pretty shocked by Tyron Woodley's performance in a couple of ways. One, because I don't think we've seen Tyron look look so off his game, and and in, in the other side of the coin, Usman just looked like an absolute killer. So, and then you got Colby as well, who who uh, who people have a lot to say about. So, what do you make of the top end? I mean, you know that that definitely was a factor uh, coming up, seeing what Usman did to to uh, to Tyron. Uh, it gives me a little bit some a, a, a little new chase uh, ahead. Um, you know, I think Usman is somebody he, he's real well rounded. Uh, and, and me as a competitor, I like I like the biggest challenge. And and I feel like you know even though he might not have the name recognition uh, that somebody like Khabib has, uh, he definitely I think he's even got more skills and a little more well rounded and and a little bigger. So uh, for me that 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 gives me a new little challenge. So I, I'm chasing on him. Um, I'll complete this one, you know, 100% of the focus is on this. And then, then we'll see where it is. You know, it, it, there's a lot of great fights out there for me at, at welterweight. So we'll, we'll see how this whole thing play out. You got Colby, you got, you got Anthony Pettis, uh, uh, Nate Diaz is back now too. So, uh, we'll see.